Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Happy Saturday. For today's video, of course, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my heaven at TJ Maxx video. You guys know I upload these videos every single Saturday. Um, we find makeup, skincare, and hair care products on a bargain. For this week, we found a decent amount of stuff. I want to say last week was a drop better, but for this week, we found like still a solid amount of items. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Let's go ahead and get started. I see that they have this angled brow brush from Pretty Vulgar. So you could use it for the brows and or for a liner maybe. Here you guys have a little bit of a better look. It looks pretty good and I think it's gonna work out nicely. It's retailing for $3.99. Next up we have this all day all night rebound travel duo here from Urban Decay. Really cool. I absolutely love the all nighter and then the rebound mist. I think I've tried and I think I also liked. It is more of a primer and this right here is more of a setting spray. So this is retailing for $9.99 and you get a ton in each. They also have these Almay makeup remover pads. So the blue one is the waterproof version. And the one of the pink packaging is gentle oil free. And these are retailing for $2.99 each. I think at the drugstore these are like six or seven. So it's a pretty good deal here. So last week we found the Urban Decay Honey Scented Sparkling Powder. This week we found the Heat one. And I think there's a cherry one as well. One of you guys pointed that out to me. So thank you so much. Um, this right here is retailing for $9.99. So here's what it looks like. It's a cardboard package. I believe the shade is more like a deep bronze. Loving the matches and the tassel is the cutest thing ever. Next they have this by La Rock. It's the Glow and Behold Shimmering Face and Body Dry Oil. This looks amazing. The color is yum. Um, so in here we're getting 1.7 fluid ounces. It looks like a pretty universally flattering shade and it's only $6.99. I love the fact that it comes with a pump. Makes it really easy to use and then also I forgot. Um, I also like to mix these in with my like body butters, body creams just to add that added glow. Next they have this face palette by Josie Marin. It's the Argan Oil Fresh Face Paint Palette. So I believe there are four cream products in here. I want to say two highlighters, a blush, and then a bronzing shade. So this right here is retailing for only $12.99. And then I want to just show you guys the packaging of the of compact. It is so beautiful. It's mirrored and I love how it says vibrancy in that colored form. It's so cute. We have some skincare restocks here. We have the Mega Mushroom Relief and Resilience um, Face Serum retailing for $59.99. We also have the Advanced Face Serum retailing for $39.99. The Eye Duty Triple Remedy Gel Cream, which I think would be great if you have oily skin, $14.99. We also have the Ultra Repair Liquid Recovery, which I wanna say is the moisturizer retailing for $14.99. I'm at the soap section for a second here. I see that Radon has these beautiful hand soaps. So we have family wash and soap. These are in glass bottles and they are retailing for $6.99. Just had to show it to you guys quickly because I just love her stuff in general. And like every time I come to TJ, I feel like I find more and more things that she makes. So I don't know, I think it's pretty cool. Heading into Marshalls, I see that they have a bunch of restocks here. Some really, really awesome goodies. This right here is actually a newer item that I've never seen. It's the La Rock Hustle and Glow Big Bronzer and Highlighter Palette. Really cute. And this right here is retailing for $7.99. Here's what the inside of the palette looks like. We get two highlighters and two bronzers, or a bronzing and a contouring shade, basically. It looks really pretty, and they are baked. Okay. Next, they have this singular shadow here by Urban Decay. There you guys can see the name. It's a matte blue, and it's retailing for $5.99. I love their singular shadows. Next, we have some of the La Rock Ultra Ego Lip Gloss. Is retailing for $3.99 each, full sizes. The pink one is in Girl Next Door, and then the coffee shade is in Visionary. I really do like their glosses. They have a slight thickish feel to them, but they still feel great and they're pretty pigmented too. Here, next up, they have the Lorac Pro Liquid Lipsticks here. These are retailing for $3.99 each as well, full sizes. So we have the shade Berry Red, Sienna, and Wisteria. At Marshalls, I see that they have a bunch of these organizers. I really like this one. I like the like bigger slot and then three small ones. This is retailing for $4.99. The quality is amazing. Emma said she has this. They also have this one right here, which is $3.99. Just one big slot you could use for like maybe palettes, single shadows, something like that. And they also have this one right here, which has three different slots retailing for $4.99. I love the quality. Um, this is the same one that we just saw before. And then they also have this one right here, which is $4.99. It's a bit deeper than the other ones, and it's more square. It also has three different, like, slots. Slots? How do you say it? Like, three different compartments. <laughs> My English! Next, we have the Laura Geller Baked Eyeshadow Duo. Really pretty. Here's what it looks like. It is $3.99. So the two shades that are included on the inside are Honey and Sable. Really pretty complimentary shades, I want to say, to kind of sweep on and go. Next up, I see that they have this little kit here by Sigma. It's the Mini Power Haul 
little kit. So we get three deluxe size brushes, a little brush cleaner, and then a little like brush pad. I've tried the brush pad, it's pretty good, and the brush cleaner is really nice too. I haven't tried these brushes necessarily, I don't think, but their brushes generally are pretty nice. And this is retailing for $19.99. I only found one piece here. They also have a bunch of these Peter Thomas Roth Irish Moore Mud uh, Purifying Cleansing Gels. I think this would be great if you have oily skin. These are huge, 8.5 fluid ounces of product. We do have a bunch here and it is retailing for $19.99, yes. <laughs> Back here I see that they have more of the honey and heat scented sparkling body powders. We saw these last week. They have some restocks now. And then in this section here we have more of the Alyssa Edwards ABH palettes, the ABH gloss holiday kit, more Fee Marc Jacobs. They also have this really pretty loose glitter here by ABH. It's in a shade that we've never seen. It's like a gray blue. Stunning. Like I always mention, you do need to use this with an adhesive to have it stick on the eye. It's in the shade Party and it's $4.99. Also in this section here, I see that they have these Almay Get Up and Glow Mascaras. It looks like it has a natural bristled one. They fully um, stocked up on these guys here and they're $3.99. I've never tried this. Um, let me know if you guys like it or not. And then I just quickly wanted to show you guys on this haul, they have a bunch of Physicians Formula restocks as well as Copper FX. These are items that we've gone over like a few times in the past. I just wanted to like kind of keep you posted. <laughs> wow. It's looking really fast. I actually don't think that I've ever seen this little kit here by Kate Somerville. It's the Kate's Minis Must Haves. So we have the exfoliating treatment. We also have the daily foaming wash and then the acne spot treatment as well. I've tried only the exfoliator and I really, really, really loved it. So this kit right here is retailing for $24.99. Next up, I see that they have this Urban Decay Heavy Dose All Nighter Mist Set. So these are two full sizes. We get 40 fluid ounces in each and it's cool because it's like a dual pack. You buy it as one unit. Um, it says on it, give one, get one, so you can keep one for yourself and you know, give one to a friend or keep both for yourself, you know what I'm saying? Or give two to a friend. This dual pack is only retailing for $19.99, so it's kind of like 10 bucks each when normally each one is like 28 on its own, so like, whoa. They also have the Marc Jacobs Youth Quick Hydra Full Retexturizing Gel Cream. So they had two pieces here retailing for only $5.99. What? There's 0.5 fluid ounces, so not a ton, but it's still a decent amount. So here you guys can see what it looks like. It's really, really cute. I actually got one of these in a Sephora favorites kit and I love using it under makeup. It just creates a really, really nice base, especially if you have a dry skin. Next up, I see that they have some of these Santa Monica palettes here by Lorac. I don't say Santa, I say Santa, but a lot of you guys are like, it's Santa. And I'm like, but I can't say it. For me, it's Santa. <laughs> Santa Monica. And these are retailing for $7.99. I know that we found this at Nordstrom Rack a while ago, but they have it now at uh, Marshalls. Here you guys can see what it looks like on the inside. Four eyeshadows, a highlighter, and then a blush. Really pretty. Um, from my experience with the Lorac shadows, they are really, really smooth and creamy. Next, I see that they have these Lorac Pore Affection Powders here. Two full sizes, both in the same shade, $5.99 each. So basically, it's their big perfecting powder. Both of the shades are in deep. Okay, then I found the final loose setting powder by ABH. Uh, we found translucent last week as well as golden orange. This week we found this one, which is in deep peach. Here you guys can see it's retailing for $12.99 full size. Next, we have this Lorac Shine Bright Color Source Light Source Cheek Palette. Look at the packaging, that is the cutest. Um, original value $29, but here it is retailing for $14.99. And then just like I mentioned before, their eyeshadows are really nice, but their face patterns are also pretty, pretty nice on the skin. They build up nicely and they're very smooth. Plus, they're pretty long-lasting. Next up, we have this Lorac Palette. This is retailing for $7.99, and it's the Venice Beach Palette. The packaging is kind of fun. So here's what it looks like on the inside. We get four shadows, a highlighter, and a either bronzy shade or a deeper highlighter. I wanted also to show you guys some of the perfumes they have here now at TJ Maxx. They have the Marc Jacobs Daisy Perfumes. So the one in the yellow packaging, the blue, and then the pink one. Um, the pink one is a 4.25 fluid ounce size bottle and it's $59.99. I think that's a four that's at least 90 or something. So definitely a bit cheaper here. All of these smell amazing. They also have a bunch of the Burberry perfumes here. I think that I've only tried the My Burberry one. So these are retailing for like $29.99. Um, what else? Yeah, most of these are $29.99 and they are um, one point, and they have 1.6 fluid ounces of product in each. Let me know which Burberry perfume is your favorite. I'm looking to get one. And then I, of course, had to show Versace Bright Crystal. This is like my best friend Rivka's signature scent. Anytime I see this, I'm like, nah, Rivka. So circling around in this section here at Marshall, let's see that they hooked us up with a ton of goodies. So some of these are restocked and some of these are items that we've never seen. So this right here was the last of the three um, scented sparkling body powders. We found the honey and heat, and this is the cherry, of course. It's retailing for... 
$9.99. And then here's what this little cutie looks like. So adorable. Again, with the tassel, love that, and the cherry. The cutest thing ever. Next up, they had this new ABH loose highlighter here, retailing for only $5.99. It's in a shade that we've never seen. So cool. It is in Vegas. And then here you guys can see the gorgeousness of this. It's like a true um, goldeny champagne color. That's how I would describe it. So, so pretty. And these are like highly pigmented, highly um, blinding on the cheeks, you know what I'm saying? And then here you guys can see what the lid looks like. I love it. They also have this pure liquid chiseled brush. That's what it's called. It looks like um, it's like a stippling kind of brush. Something that I probably personally will use for like cream bronzer or cream blush or something. And it's $4.99. And then they also have these pure skin perfecting um, concealer brushes. You can use for concealer or foundation to kind of swipe on the face. $4.99. I've tried the artist Artiste ones and they're really good. I've never tried the pure ones though. Next up we have this kit here from Rachel Zoe and Lorac. This is the Alter Ego Golden Era Lip Set. I love the packaging. The black and white is really pretty. And this is retailing for $7.99. We basically get three full-size lip products, so a gloss, a lipstick, and a lip liner. Their glosses are great, their lipsticks are great. The lip liners I've never tried, but they're all in the same shade. Ginger Blonde, this perfect nude. These look amazing. And I love how like the packaging is the same because they're kind of like stationary, you know. They also have this makeup eraser here. So we usually find the one, the pink one, basically the main one. But this is the Plum Crazy color, which I think is kind of cute. So it's just in this plummy shade and it's $7.99. So they have them now at TJ. They do have a bunch of restocks on the ABH Loose Highlighters and Marc Jacobs Bronzers. I know a bunch of you guys were looking out for that. They do have more TJ Lorac Lip Products, Lorac Face Palettes, and um, what's it called? <laughs> One second, Lime Crime Lip Products as well. Next up, we have this Beauty Sleep in a Box Kit by Clinique. So we get the Moisture Surge um, Moisturizer, the Eye Cream, and a Mascara for $14.99. It's, it's kind of a cute kit if you were wanting to try out these products. I think it's priced pretty well-ish. There are two brand new uh, Lime Crime Velveteen liquid lipsticks here, like two brand new shades that we've never seen. These are of course $5.99 full sizes. So this one right here is in the shade Cherished and it is a metallic liquid lipstick. It's like a brownish bronzy shade. And then we have the shade Happy, H-A-P-P-I, and this is like a rose goldeny color. Next, TJ Maxx has a bunch of these Milani liquid lip colors. These look really good. This is in the shade 10 Enchanting. Um, I've tried a few of Milani's liquid lipsticks and they're pretty good. I don't think I've tried this one though, but their lip products in general usually are pretty nice. And these are retailing for $2.99 each. We then have this shade right here in Idol. It's more of like a deeper rosy color. Here we have the shade Desire. It's a burgundy color. This one right here is in Charming. It seems like it's a perfect nude. I love these kind of shades. And then this one right here seems like it's more of a cool tone shade in Tenderness. Cool tone nude. They have a bunch of these Milani The Rocket mascaras. You guys can see here. I remember when this came out. I think I tried it years, years, years ago and I thought it was pretty good. Um, Maybelline does have amazing mascaras in general. And this right here is in Very Black. It's cool to see that they have this shade. Because um, usually they'll bring the browns here, but this is Very Black and it's $3.99. And then they also have a bunch of these Maybelline Colossal Mascaras with the purple writing and then the blue writing as well. These are also $3.99 each. Then I see that they have the L'Oreal Million Lashes Excess Mascara here. I've never tried this formula. It looks pretty good. It's in black. And this is also $3.99. And then of course we have the classic, the Full Seas Mascara by Maybelline in very black. I remember I went through at least three or four of these um, when I just started out with makeup. I remember it was really good. They have these three strobe light illuminators here by Milani. We have platinum bronze, rose gold, and pure gold. And these are retailing for only $2.99 each. It's fine. It's <laughs> okay. <laughs> they also have this e.l.f. Molten Liquid Eyeshadow in brushed copper. Yeah, brushed copper. It's a beautiful coppery color. Yeah. $3.99. Next up, we have this Pure Festival palette here. There was only one piece. Emma's gonna go ahead and purchase this for herself. Here you guys can see what the shades look like and it's retailing for $7.99. Emma, do you let me open it up? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't mind. Here you guys can see what the palette looks like. We get some mattes, some metallics, and some of those like loose glitters, which don't perform the bestest on the eyes. I think that we actually received this in BoxyCharm about a year ago. I do like the color story because it's a nice neutral palette with a pop of like pink. Um, like I think the mattes and the metallics work well, but just those glitters are a little bit of a, a tough cookie to work with. <laughs> and then, this is so exciting, this is the Urban Decay Naked Cherry Highlight and Blush Palette. I own this, I really, really love it. We found this at Nordstrom Rack last year, but we've never seen it at TJ, so pretty exciting. Emma's purchasing this for herself as well. There was only one piece and it was on clearance for 12 buckaroos. The packaging is just like the box, really cutesy. 
Ah, yeah. I, I gave you the eyeshadow? Yeah. I did? I really don't remember, honestly. <laughs> yeah? I remember I gave you the... That one and that one also. Oh. Right, okay, now I, I remember. Do not give it to someone else. Uh, <laughs> yeah, now I remember. So we get two highlighters and then one blush in the middle. The blush is a beautiful um, cherry shade. It just glides on the skin stunningly. Um, the highlighter, one highlighter is more champagne and the other one is like white, but it has like a pinky undertone to it. Next up, we have this Pure and Trolls World Tour little palette. It just This always just reminds me of my niece. She always says like, Trolls World Tour. So cute, $4.99. There are a few little color stories floating around from this collection. We only found the pink one so far. The packaging is so cute. Look at that. So here's what the actual little palette looks like. Here are what the shades look like. So yeah, definitely more of like a pinky toned palette. Very pretty though. I actually own this in like the neutral one, the blue one, and the purple one. And they swatch amazingly. Super smooth, very creamy. And to find it here for five bucks is just like wow. I'm curious to see if they're going to be getting like the whole line here. Because I feel like I kind of need to have them all in my life, you know? Um, but yeah, Emma's going to go ahead and purchase this one for herself. Did I mention that already? I think I did, but <laughs> this is how much. <laughs> Next up, we have this Milani Intense Bronze Glow Face and Body Powder Bronzer. I think there was only one shade. It's in 01. So the price of this is $2.99, Emma mentioned. Here's what the palette looks like. It's beautiful. It's mirrored. It's gold. Here's what it looks like. It's pretty massive. We get a ton of product in here, and it's like a deep bronzy shade. Also, like I mentioned, it's in 01, so they do have a few other shades in the line, but we only found this so far, and this has 17 grams of product. Um, for reference, usually bronzers have like about 10, so you can just imagine how huge this is. Okay, and this is something that Emma purchased for herself. Emma, how much was this? $9.99. It was $9.99, but you said it was on clearance? For five. for five bucks, which is amazing. I think we get a deluxe size of the tattoo liner in Trooper from Kat Von D, the Kat Von D Saint perfume, and the Sinner perfume as well. I owned Saint and Sinner like in a small rollable spray version. Um, Saint is a bit more lighter. It kind of reminds me of like Juicy Couture, I want to say, if, if my memory serves me well. And then Sinner is a bit more stronger, slightly stronger, um, but still really, really nice. Yeah, they're both good. They're good. One is for morning, one is for Yeah, one is like a playful and fun, the next one yeah. is seductive. Yeah. <laughs> they also have this makeup eraser here um, in the floral version, which is also really cute, and it is also retailing for $7.99. This right here, where's the price? Where's the price? Yeah, $7.99. This one right here is at Marshall. It's kind of cute. I see that they also have a bunch of these pst, um, dry shampoos here. So this one right here is the color safe version, and this is the unscented original one. The unscented original is $3.99, 5.3 fluid ounces, and then this one is, what is it called? Retailing for $3.99 as well. I believe it's the same size. They also have this right here from the Sebastian brand. Emma mentioned that it's a really good hair care brand. So in here we're getting a conditioner, shampoo, a oil, and then a mist from what it seems like. These, product look, these products look really, really good. We got your legs in it, Emma. We got your legs in the video. <laughs> it's cool, it's cool. And this is $19.99. At Marshall, they also have this wool here of hair accessories. I just wanted to run through them in case you guys were curious. Uh, we got some clips, scrunchies, all of that. This headband right here looks gorgeous. It looks really like rich and just like sophisticated, especially going into the full months. And it is retailing for $4.99. Wow, I like it. It has a good sweatery feel. And then I wanted to show you guys that they have this ABH liquid lipstick kit. So we found the lip, uh, the gloss kit that looks very, very similar to this a few weeks back, but we haven't found this yet, I don't believe. This right here is retailing for $49.99. So here's what the liquid lipstick kit looks like online. We get 10 full size. ABH liquid lipsticks in various different colors you guys can see. Some of these look like um, they're, they have like a matte finish to them and some of these look like they have like a um, metallic finish to them. But yeah, I'm going to just show you guys the shades that we're working with. Next up I see that they have the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette here. There's no price on it, but I'm assuming it's $19.99. Emma mentioned that that was the price. Um, this is so cool. I hope that we find more items from the line. Um, and this is their like newer nine pan like eyeshadow formula so amazing to see it here let me tell you and here you guys can see what the packaging looks like it's super beautiful and then here are what the shades look like on the inside so we get nine shades in total three bigger shades and uh six smaller shades but yeah most of the shades are like cool toned neutrally um, matte colors Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what TJ Maxx and Marshalls had to offer. Now let me share with you guys the only item that I picked up. I just picked up a headband. 
Um, and I, I was feeling this. Emma pointed it out. And I was like, yeah, I need to have it. I feel like with the right outfit, it would like pop, especially going into the full months. You know what I'm saying? I didn't pick up any makeup or skincare items because I actually just placed a massive order on Sephora site. And there really wasn't anything too specific I wanted at TJ. So didn't pick up any makeup for this week, but hopefully um, for next week. Let me know what products you guys found at TJ Maxx and at Marshalls. And yeah, I'm looking forward to your comments down below. Also, tomorrow I plan on putting up my Ulta 21 Days of Beauty event video. A lot of you guys asked me about that. And yeah, okay, that's what I really wanted to tell you guys. All right, I will speak to you guys in the comments below. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.